And we are back once again with more fortune summoners. All right. Um, what were we doing? Oh yeah, we have to find crests of the wind or something like that. I do believe. And I think. Oh my god, it's been like twenty minutes. Why can't I remember this? I think one of them. I think she said one of them is at this place by. Sana said one of them is at a place by her house, and then the other one is somewhere out of town. I think we're gonna do the one by her house first, but I just remember before that I wanted to go in here and look at weapons and stuff. Oh yeah, it's the uh, scantily clad fighter looking person who resembles a character from another game, I think. Welcome, welcome, I've got new weapons in stock. Give them a good look. All right, bronze sword, iron dagger, iron sword. I have cloth armor. I don't have the leather armor. What is that? I would very much appreciate stats and stuff. It's hollow, so this might actually be an iron pipe and not a real staff. Oh, that's cool. Mattress beater. Wooden stick for dusting mattresses. Also quite handy for dusting other things. Right then. Um... I think I'm going to just break bank and get the iron sword. Oh, there we go. We get to see the stat. Oh, wait. What? <laughs> You've got stats. What do you do? Chiffon. That'll raise it by 10. She can't equip that. What is the point of the iron dagger? Bronze sword. Is that what she has? No. Oh. Raise her attack by that. No. Oh. Well, does that even matter for her? Let's see what this does. That'll raise that by five. Raise her by ten. Ooh. I might just go for that. Hmm. No, I want the sword. Would you like to buy the iron sword? Yes, I would. Thank you. Anything else I can grab for you? Sell? Oh. I don't think anything I have is worth anything. Yeah, no. No, that's quite alright. Nope. Alright, let's go equip that real quick. Oh, it's already equipped. My stomach is still making sounds. I just ate. <laughs> stomach, stop! What are you doing? Yeah, she's already got that equipped. That's cool. It auto-equips it. Alright, next time we buy armor. Unless much better weapons. I always prioritize the weapons. That's how you get to Archie's house. And I'm pl plenty stocked up on items. I think that's Sana's house. That's some other house. Can I talk to you? Oh my god. Oh, there's the hiccup burp things. Oh, I should be reading this. Supposedly an artifact with connection to the spirits of the wind lies enshrined within. That's cool. Let's go over and check it out then, shall we? Oi! You gonna let me in, Mr. Guard person? Sigh, if only I could visit some place like Barnes, even, then I might... Go on in. Hey, you two! No one is allowed beyond this point. Wait, isn't this the Shrine of Wind? Why can't we go inside? Rainwater's been flooding inside for years and it's become a monster den. It's very dangerous. But, but I need to, or we need to go inside. Please let us in. Please let us in. Please! I don't know what you kids want to do in there, but no means no. Aww. Right then, I guess we're just gonna go to Barnes first. Can I get up there? I see a chest up there. Hmm. I can't switch to him. Alright. Nope. One last try. Can I, I feel like... Yeah, you just can't get up there. And I just noticed I have mail. Messages. Weapon shop. Oh, wait. Hey, little customer. I've got some new weapons in stock. Oh, that's cool. I just found that out. Found a stone, but... This is so cool. Way back in... Way in the back of the cave, we found a really old elemental stone and two mysterious stone tablets. I, um, think I dropped somewhere. Some, one somewhere, though. 
Anyway, we had Miss Class President read the other one, and apparently to lift the seal on the stone and cure Chiffon's, um, amnesia? His forgetful thing. <laughs> god, oh my god, Archie. We need three thingies called Crests of the Wind. Apparently they're, they will be in places related to the wind. San and the others think the best place to start looking will be the Shrine of Wind here in Tonkiness and Weathervane Tower near Barnas. So we'll do that. Yeah, well, we can't go in this place, so let's go to Barnas. Gotta go this way, all the way over here. Sana, do you want to say, like, goodbye to whoever you live with? Say goodbye to your family, Sana. We're going on a journey. This is her house, right? Or am I in the wrong place? Say goodbye to your family. This isn't my family. Nope, that's the class president's house. Is this Sana's house? I think this is. Yeah, this is. Welcome home, Sana, and hello, Archie. Hello, Miss Sana's mom. <laughs> Hi, Mama. Going out to play with Archie for a bit, okay? Alright, then, do be careful, dear. I will. Sana, you've been so happy lately. Is this because you're with Archie? Is it? It's because you're with Archie, isn't it? Yep. Yeah. Sana is adorable. I'll be not a very sociable person. Alright, off to Barnas. You're not gonna let me leave, are you? Oh, he is, okay. Can't stop me! Gotcha! Oh my god! Can I check the sign? Down and up. Wait. Beware of moth bees. Interesting. I am very strong. Oh, it's these. And there's that sleep that I remember reading them out. Get up! Oh my god, you stay asleep so freaking long. Alright, these things. Now I know why people complain about these things. Oh wow, I got myself completely lost. Oh, hello person. A while back I was visiting Tonkinus and wanted to see the Shrine of the Wind. Monsters came out of the entrance and tried to attack me. But then, the guard who watches the shrine entrance saved my life. He was such a wonderful man. Uh -huh. Oh, I think I have a good idea of what to do. Not a slime bean. North lies Barnes and Ch Chartreau. Chartreau, I don't know. But as you can see, the bridge is out at the moment. Sorry. It's okay, I got mad hops. A guardian drop. Oh, I bet that raises defense. Oh, fucking hell. Alright. Nope, you know what? I'm not a quitter. Okay, and I just fell again. Just to add to my own punishment. I don't think so, Mothby. No, you... Don't. Oh! Oh god. None of your- none of your powder. None of your sleep powder. Oh my god. Oh, he got us both. Ha! Huh, she woke up! Why did she wake up so fast? Oh yeah, I got a guardian drop. Let's use that. Items. Guardian drop. Raise- Increases resist permanently. Alright, Archie gets it. Okay, off we go. Alright, um, I'm thinking... Yeah, that's great, I have another one of those. I'm thinking I have to go talk to that guard again. Tell him that there's some lady that wants his D. And he's like, oh, because, you know, when you get your D asked, feels G. <laughs> and he's just going to be like, gone. Oi. 
Mr. Guard Dude, I can't talk. I can't stand directly in front of you. What the hell do I do? You're not gonna let me go. Yeah, we need to go. Please. No. Alright. So what do I do? the hell is that? Heroically fighting off the occasional slime and moth bee. Just once I wish something big would happen in this town. Wait, no, I shouldn't say that. Don't give fate any ideas. Alright, not that way. Wait, can I break these? I can! I got money! Five copper. Wonderful. I just have to start talking to everyone in town, because that's a drag. You get hurt in a fight, you should try using the quick heal function. Quick heal will use the most appropriate item you have to restore your HP. Just hit F2 to activate it. If you have any part have a party, it'll be used on the most injured party member by percentage of HP remaining. Oh, so you don't have to switch. I thought I'd just use it on whoever you were playing. That's really handy. Okay. This isn't where I want to go. Oh my god. Noise while I adjust my chair because it slid off to the side. And then got like stuck because the weight pushed it in the carpet and the wheels wouldn't move. Um, You know what? I'm exploring the boutique. Hello! I would like your finest everything. This is a clothing store. Yeah, I, I noticed. Woolen gloves. Oh, that actually raises a stat. Interesting. Oh, that's cool. I like that blue. I don't like the green. Loose smock. That's just darker than what she's wearing. Okay. Green clothes. Wait. Oh, you can actually change his clothing. That's nice, I suppose. No, I don't want anything. Go away. Well, what am I supposed to do? Alright, I'm going back over to this place. And I'm going to see what happens. Wait, 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 wait. There's another guard way off on the way to the cave. There's no reason for me to believe that he has anything to do with this, but it's worth a shot. And then, you know, it turns out I just have to push the box all the way onto the button, and that will let me get in. This snake clearly doesn't know how to fight either. It's good. Did he heal me? No. You get him, Sana. What is Chiffon doing? Like, what is the point of him? Don't get me, 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 don't get me. Oh, he doesn't hurt. Oh, he's starting to hurt. Okay, so everyone is still at school. Uh, let's go in here and talk to people. Stella's never been one to talk much. She always goes home right after class ends. Wait, no. I skipped. Maybe I should go find Stella. Okay. Yeah, but I can't go to either of those places, so what am I supposed to do? I don't know. I'm gonna go here, and then I'm gonna go back to town and just, like, scour the place for Stella. Not. Nah. Oh, he said yep. And I said not, nah, nerds. 
Oh, they both just jumped right over that. Sonny, you got played. Okay. Hey, mister, why are you standing here? You're from Minas Aretas, right? I'm here to make sure you kids don't go past this gate without permission. Huh? Why do we need permission? Karat Village is beyond here, but monsters on the road are very fierce. As a result, students can't go past here without direct permission from the school. Huh? Okay. Alright, well that's not where I want to go then. Alright, let's go look for Stella then. Just search the town for the person with their nose highest in the air. I'm gonna fall into a hole. Oh my god, I made that jump. Okay. <laughs> maybe, maybe I'll just look for the person screaming plebeians. She just used the shield, I think. That's great. It's not Hana, but we're not fighting. So, that was pointless. Oh my god. If this takes too much longer, I might actually cut. Oh, I didn't check when I started recording. So, there might be a break here in a moment. Okay, I'm back everyone, after, I don't know, uh, a half an hour to 40 minutes of running around trying to figure out what to do, I decided to wander into this house again and talk to the old lady. Apparently her grandson is the guard sitting in front of the shrine, and he forgot his lunch, and I'm gonna go take him his lunch. How I ever was supposed to realize that this is where I needed to go is beyond me, but let me just roll away. Team Archie and Sana, roll out. All right. If I sound, I don't know, irritated, it's, it's only slightly, I'm completely annoyed at the situation. Oh God, hey. Excuse me, Mr. Guard, your grandma asked us to bring you this lunch. Huh? You brought it all this way for me. Thank you, girls. I can't leave here and I was just getting hungry. Alright, time to dig in. Wow, a yummy looking lunch. What a yummy looking lunch. It looks really yummy. Doesn't it? My grandmother is the finest cook in town, you know. You really love your grandma, don't you, Mr. Guard? You bet I do. That's why I'd really like to get married soon and make sure she can see her great-grandchildren, but... All I do is stand here all day when no, where no one passes by and I can't meet a young lady like this. Ow. Well, um... Um, don't give up. I'm sure you'll meet someone nice. Really, getting cheered on by little girls feels a bit pathetic, though. <laughs> it should. I am gonna try talking to you again before talking to the lady that says she wants your D. Okay, you said the same thing. Alright, let's go get the lady that likes his D. I'm gonna actually have to cut this soon because when I stopped and started searching I checked and I had been recording for six like yeah, sixteen minutes or so already, so I'm gonna get into the frickin' Oh my god, burp, stop. I'm gonna get into the frickin' shrine before anything. But god, hot nerd. You know what? It's faster to just kill you than try to escape. See? These things suck so much. Only if they're good, though. Oh, yeah, see? These ones got wrecked. I got honey. Ah, this is the lady that wants his D. Hey. Hey. He wants you. That soldier who saved me was wonderful. I wish I could... Speak to him once more or something. Hey miss, do you mean the guard who stands in front of the Shrine of Wind all the time? Oh, oh dear, did you hear me talking to myself? You were talking to me! Uh-huh. 
You know, that guard man was saying he wanted to get married. He was? Oh dear, oh dear, what should I do? This must be fate. Yes, and there, floating in the air, is our Cupid of Love. But I'm not a Cupid, I'm a wind element. Hey, miss, why don't you write a love letter to the guard? I can deliver it for you. Ah, uh, a l -l -l love letter. Oh, this is so embarrassing. Ah, he's a lucky man, though. But love letters are embarrass uh, embarrassing. Oh my god. I kind of guess that's n going to be... Uh, that's going a bit far, huh? No, no, no. It's a great idea. Please do it. Uh, okay. Give me a moment. I must put my very heart in the paper. Or my very heart the paper. Why don't you just go, like, walk up to it and say, Hey, I want your D. And he's just going to be like, Go for it. And done. Please see my letter safely to him. You obtained the love letter. Oh my, oh my. It feels like ages since I wrote a love letter. I'm all a fluster. Hey, what's written in the letter? Can we look? Please don't. It's a secret, you see. Don't worry, I know. Don't read it either. Er, Chiffon. We'll go deliver it, miss. Alright. Huh. <sighs> So there's a lot of running back and forth on top of running in circles trying to figure out what to do. I'm just gonna kill these things. I don't care. God. I'm just so done with this game. It's fun, but it's finicky and it's not very clear. Uh, yeah, I'm going the right way. He's gonna, like, leave to go talk to her or something. Oh my gosh. Archie gave the guard the love letter. A letter for me? Did you write this, girl? Er, no, no. It's from a pretty lady in front of the bridge to Barnes. Apparently it's embarrassing. Write things written on it. Embarrassing things? What kind of fool game are you kids trying to play on me? We're not really not trying to trick you, honest. Chiffon, don't say stuff like that. Sorry. Letter is from a lady you saved from monsters near the shrine, sir. Now you mention it, I do remember something like that. Well, no harm in taking a look, I suppose. Let's see. Hmm. Wait, what? She's this, that, there? Go, man! Yes, yes, I see. I see now. This is fight destiny. That is meant to be. Um, you kids said she was at the bridge, right? Okay, I'm gonna go talk, talk to her. Yeah, talk to her. This right this second. Oh my God! Speak, plus thanks, words. Kids, thanks for giving me this letter. I need to, I need to leave it for a bit. But don't go into the shrine, okay? Y yeah. Uh, we'll uh, do that. The guard shirt took off in a hurry. Alright, now let's go into the shrine while he's gone. Huh? But, but is it okay for us to? It's okay, don't worry. Did you see the hearts in his eyes? He'll be gone a while. That's not really what I meant. Yeah, we're totally just gonna sit out here. Shrine of Wind. This already has water temple vibes and I don't like it. So this is the inside of the Shrine of Wind. Sh shrine of Wind. It's all flooded, just like the guard said. It's not we're counting on you. Do your watery thing. I'll do my best. Gotta switch to her. And I'm gonna cut the episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode.